hey guys good morning um sorry about my kitchen today is like my first day of actually being like unemployed even though i'm still working so not really unemployed long story anyway um i am going to cut my hair today because it's 30 dollars if i go get it done somewhere professionally or two dollars and 17 cents if i do it myself because all i needed was a comb and scissors, which I picked up at Dollar Tree. And the Sharpie that I had on hand already. Probably have a comb somewhere too. I normally use a brush, not sure. And a hair tie that I also already had on hand. So um, I'm very nervous about this. What I'm going to do is um, not cut it to the length, um, like not cut it super short because if I do mess this up really bad, I want to make sure I have long enough hair to go get it fixed somewhere with that $30 haircut. What I'm doing first is just going to comb everything out. My hair is super fine. I don't expect this process to take very long. But apparently my hair is also very tangled, so it might. I highly recommend a mirror, by the way. Um, so you can mark where you want on your hair. I was going to use hair chalk, but I can't find where I put it, to be honest with you. Uh, you ready? I'm so nervous. Okay, well, I saw this on some YouTube video, by the way. Hmm, ironically, right? Um, where you just pull your hair up into a, um, a ponytail on top of your head. Yeah, cut it where you want it cut, and ta-da, you have layers. Let's see if it really comes out that easily. My cat, always eager to help. Next, I'm taking the Sharpie. I want my hair about this length on my shoulder width length, but um, I don't trust myself really, so I'm going for right under it. I'm going to mark my hair off with the Sharpie. Be able to see, but side, and then we're gonna take this side. Can match up the lengths. As you can see, um, this is why I don't trust myself. Okay, so now what we're gonna do, by the way, Sharpie, it'll come out of my hair. It'll be okay. All right. We are going to pull my hair up into a ponytail on the very top of my head. Going on top of my head. Like this. Shoot, I forgot a before picture. Oh well. Okay, gonna tie the ponytail. I don't know how tight it has to be. Okay. And I am going to comb this through again because it feels like a tangled mess. And I do not see where I marked my Sharpie at. Because smart me. Hmm. Did not mark it very clearly. This is where hair chalk would have come in a lot better. I know it's quite a bit. So. All right, well, we'll see here. I'm losing confidence in myself. Pretty sure I'm gonna have to go get this cut somewhere else. Anyway, so move the garbage can closer and then just cut 
like downward, but like straight across. All right, and there's half of my hair missing now. So let's take it down. Oh my gosh, that was short. Let's see how I did. Well, hey, that came out pretty cool. There you have it. Let me go brush it out and look in a rear mill, a real mirror, and then I'll show you. And that is how you cut. Wait, that is not as short as I wanted it. Anyway, that is how you cut it here. And now we shall see. Adjusted. Oh, hey. You know what? With some action, like a um, a hair dryer, this could work for me. Oh well, or on the um on the long side, but it's a lot shorter than it was. Ta-da! <laughs> All right. Um. Yeah. Well, that is the difference between a two dollar and seventeen cent haircut compared to a thirty dollar short haircut. You really don't know what you're gonna get, but it looks okay. So I'm gonna leave it at that. All right. Thanks for watching. After doing this, I decided I wanted my hair shorter, so I cut. It, um front wise myself so here you can see that all right thank you all for watching have a great day